gave you the idea that you wanted to really be a walking computer? So I've always been a tech enthusiast and I always try to be on the cutting edge of technology. So that drove Brandon DeLawley to do what some might believe only takes place in a science fiction movie. It gets inserted into your skin. A chip, and not the type you eat, but a microchip, has been implanted in Brandon's left hand. This oh, one wow. is just a little guy right there. Yeah, I see that right there. Yeah. Definitely. So after that was inserted and it, the swelling went down, uh, I'm able to open up the front and back door to my house. I can uh, walk up to people and have them tap their phone to my hand and instantly transfer my contact information, my portfolio, my COVID vax card. But Brandon got to thinking, why stop there? He's got two hands, right? And plenty of room for more chips. So I thought, how cool would it be if I could leave my house, no car key, no house key. So two weeks ago, right here in Michigan, Brandon got another chip implanted, this one in his right hand, to unlock and start his Tesla. It's a perfect backup, something you can never forget, something that doesn't break, uh, something that won't fail you. And if you think having chips implanted in your body requires a doctor or is costly, well, think again. The chips themselves are anywhere from between two and three hundred dollars, and the install only ran me about a hundred dollars because you can go to a local piercing shop who will obviously agree to do the installation. All the programming and coding of putting the apps on the chip, that's all done by me. Moving forward, Brandon is thinking about having other chips implanted in his body. So it'll be inserted right under or right over your breast, and then you can tap your phone to your chest and instantly get temperature readings. And with all this talk about chips, Brandon hopes the chip for the Tesla gets the attention of you know who. It would make all this worth it if maybe just like a thumbs up for Milan or something or a simple emoji. I don't know, that would be pretty cool. In Oakland County, Ingrid Kelly, Fox 2 News.